What we have here, very underappreciated member of the population, the Maasai Mara, the buffalo. Hello, buffalo. How are you? Lovely to see you. Yes. Chewing your grass, are you? I suppose that's what you do, really, isn't it? Yes, you do. I see your ears are a bit mangled. Yes. Have you run through a few thorn bushes? Fought off a few lions in your time? Your eyes look a little bit scaly, to be honest. I think you maybe need some anti-aging cream, the stuff that Jerry puts on me before we go to TV. I'll bring you some next time I come past here. And some flies in your eyes, how lovely. <laughs> Any stories to tell a buffalo like this? Now they tend to lose their hair as they get a bit older, of course. And if you look at his belly, he looks like a character from the Game of Thrones. He's got grey scale. Like Sir Jorah Mormont, till he was cured, of course, by Samuel Tarly. <laughs> if you don't get that illusion, please don't worry about it. It's not important. Now this fellow, I think, has got a slightly less than impressive set of horns. He looks like a South African buffalo. You look like a South African buffalo. Yes. Your horns are the same size as theirs. Which means you're fairly well, shall we say, not as well endowed as some others in this particular area. I feel I've been slightly insulting to this fellow. He's tried to be friendly to me and now he's going to show me his best end. I do apologize. I know that you're an old fellow. You've seen a lot. You're a magnificent creature. I take nothing away from all the things you've achieved. Roshni, you say if only this buffalo could talk. Yes, I agree. Although I think given what I've said to him, he'd probably swear at us. I'm constantly astounded by actually how agile they are. That thing doesn't look like it could run quickly. It looks like it's a sort of big, fat, feeble lump. But they are immensely powerful. And pretty fast, certainly much faster than us. goes, wandering off in a slight sulk down towards the valley below Serena. Serena is the headquarters of the Masai Mara. There it is in the background there. There's a lodge there. Headquarters of the Mara Triangle, sorry. And Chris, as we look to see if we can find anybody having a shower uh, in their room, um, I'm joking, we're not really trying to do that. Chris, you say, how long do buffalo live? They live for potentially 20 years or so. I suspect in captivity they could probably live up to 20 years, maybe a little bit longer even. Out here, I think they'd be lucky to get beyond sort of 18. <laughs> 